Hey everyone and welcome to this video. In this one we're gonna take a look at the iPhone or iPhone 13 and how to close apps on this device and it's actually pretty simple because of course it depends on what you mean by that but the most obvious thing is for example if you open up a camera to close the app you just swipe up from the bottom and you just minimize and close the app but in order to close it from the running apps in the background just grab it from the bottom like this and so wipe it up to make it go away so this is pretty much how you can close the apps on the iPhone however if you mean that you would like to switch wipe up on all of them or like to close all of the apps which you can see right here then it's not really possible to just swipe once to close all of them however you can use uh, both fingers or you can use two of them to swipe two apps at the same time so you can go like this and it's gonna save you some time of course so not only with two fingers but if you move it up like this you can actually use three fingers to swipe up on three of the most recent apps so you can see that i mean it kind of glitches out a bit but yes you can see you can grab three fingers and swipe up on all of them you, you could see that it glitched out really badly so pretty much just use two fingers or one to swipe up on all of them however like i said there is no like one button to close all of the apps in the background it just doesn't work that way also another thing which you can mean by that is the background app refresh for example apps like weather or calendar are always waiting for the internet connection to happen so whenever they are connected to the internet they are they are constantly fetching new information for you and in order to disable it to save battery life to save data whatever you need to go to the settings and then you need to go to the uh, general section and here is a background app refresh so here you can control which apps can be and are allowed to be refreshed in the background you have like a quick explanation in here which means that the content when on wi-fi or similar in the background should be refreshed so turning off apps may help preserve battery life so here's like a main toggle which you can enable for all of the apps so here you can disable it altogether for every single app on your iphone or only use wi-fi which would make sense if you pay for selling data but yeah if you want to have it individual then you can just turn on and off individual apps and it just works uh, the way that you decide that it should work so this is also another way of looking at closing apps on an iPhone however if you come back to the home screen in order to close an app you may also mean something else for example I have one uh, app in here is the audible app in order to close it or to like make it disappear I can hold down on it then uh, edit the home screen and now it's going to start to like jiggle and now I can click on the minus icon. I'm not going to delete the app because that would just remove it completely from my device. Instead, I'm going to remove it from the home screen, which means that it's going to disappear from this home page. It's not accessible in here, but if I swipe all the way to, to the right, you can see that here it is actually part of my list. So here you can see that the audible app is here so I can do whatever I want with it. It is always on my iPhone. It just doesn't bother me here on the on the home screen so this would be it hope this is actually what you were looking for and what you wanted to find out about your iphone if this video helped you i'd make sure to subscribe to the fox tech channel and I'll see you guys later